I mean, I'm, I was glad I was able to get, you know, be able to get that uh, that acknowledgement because there's so many so, so many great players in this league. So to be able to be able recognized by the, you know, the committee and coaches and media, that you know, it means a lot. But you know, it is, it's no reason for me to settle at all. You know, I'm trying to not as much just me be an uh, individual accomplishment. I'd like, you know, it's all about our team here. So I'm glad I got it. But you know, I got to come out and prove why, you know, why they selected me as that. So I have a lot of work to put in, you know, during the season. He's been a really good leader for our team. Somebody that kind of just shows the younger guys the way. And all the fans and supporters remember last year as far as what he meant to this team in big moments. And to have that as a coach, another guy that's not afraid of those moments and can excel when we need him to is a tremendous asset. And I'm really, really excited for his season. He deserves it. It's a really good league. Very tough league. Every night's a, a battle, as cliche as that sounds. In our league, it's it's like that. And you know, we weren't ranked first in the preseason polls last year, and we we did what we were supposed to do. And I think as long as we take care of ourselves every day, we get better and improve in the areas that are necessary. I think by the end, we'll be where we need to be. That's the great thing about the SoCon. You know, we got to see some of that last year. You know, within the league, everybody knew how good of a league it was, but I think nationwide it opened some people's eyes up where you have three or four really, really good teams from NCAA tournament standpoint. But the good thing is it challenges you every single day to come out here, get better. Like you said, all the preseason stuff, you know, that, that's good, I think, for the fans and for the media, but for the guys, you know, in the court, it's all about how can we get better every single day. It's, it's easy for me to tell the guys what we need to do because I know I know what it was like, what, what we went through last year. And so to be able to tell our guys, you know, help them out through everything, to know it's going to be a long year and, uh, you know, just trying to keep everybody's heads up, keep everybody boosted up in spirits. Because, you know, right now, beginning of the season, two week, three weeks in, it's always rough, no matter what year it is. So just keep everybody's heads up, keep everybody focused, keep everybody hungry. And during the season, you know, no matter how many games we win or lose in a row, keep everybody really hungry is what we did last year. So if we could do that this year again, we'll have a really good chance to win the league again.